What is that? Hello everyone and welcome back to another video on the channel and today we are back in Juniors. Now, in the last one we beat Night 5 and also had a very interesting one of the little animation things where something weird happened in the end. If you haven't seen the last part, link to the play was with it up, will be up here at some point. Anyway, let's get into Night 6. Adventure into the unknown? I guess we're as ready as we'll ever be. Yeah. The door will lead you straight to the center of the basement. There we'll, where we'll find our ghosts. Now, I took a peek and scouted out the basement while you were doing your investigation. Did you see anything? Well, from what I could ink out, it seems like the ghost has turned the basement into their own old game. Alright, then we need a plan. I think we go along with whatever game the ghost is trying to play with us and trap her by surprise. Well, how are we going to trap the ghost? <coughs> Trevor here along with other corrupt spirits. We let them rot as I have for centuries. Alright, then. This is it. If this works, Paul, I may never see you again. So I guess this is goodbye. Juniors ends tonight. Fun. Oh. Wait, is something? Oh, there's a door. <coughs> well, I'm going to get a quick sip of water. Because hydration is my passion. What is that? <coughs> what the hey is this? How do you do this? It seems like we have two and we seem to be screwed. What is this? <coughs> yeah, I kind of guessed that. How do you wind it? Oh, okay, that's not. Now how do you do this? Okay, that's fun. What is this? What is this?
What is this? See, it's epic. That's for sure. This thing is epic. Come on, stupid mouse. Do your job. This is so intense. You left thinking of your mask. Okay. Jesus Christ, this game is intense all of a sudden. Okay. Okay, this... This game is intense. I love this and both hate this at the same time. dead but wow this this is amazing
Okay. Two things I have to say. One, this is very difficult. And two, God, this is amazing. Wow. I think I need to watch some videos on how to actually beat this because... Or, actually, I think I'm going to try just one run and not commentate. I have to say, though, this is amazing. Worst thing for it, though, is the fact that there's not a button for the cameras. So, that's a bit of a bad thing, but otherwise, this, this is so cool. Anyway, I'll see you in a bit. Okay, guys, I don't know if you guys saw that, but I just died. So, I need to find out how this works, because this... I don't even know what the goal of this is. So yeah, I will be back when I figure this all out. And yeah. Anyway, I'll be back. Eventually. Okay, I think we've done it. <coughs> okay. I don't fully understand what's going on, but we've done it. <coughs> Beware the mango. Don't make this more difficult than it has to be. You know you can't be here. That's not good. Are we screwed? Okay, uh... Good. Nope, we're screwed. Please tell me that this has checkpoints. Use her line on main ghost yet. Okay. Okay, the game's merciful. <laughs> oh, this is amazing, though.
Jesus, this is hard. Okay, trial and error. <coughs> I'll be back when I successfully do it. Okay, we've gone farther. battery which is not good they were screwed Okay, question is, what happens? <coughs> Let me in. Wait, did we lose? Where are you? Please don't hurt me. I knew you were here all along. While you were sitting in here behind that costume, I was waiting. Waiting so patiently for another one of your little puppets to look where but they weren't supposed to. Once I'm done with you, I'm going to take your little puppet and split his skull. Not this time. He's different. Oh, really? Let me ask you this. What makes you think he will be able to avenge your spirit now? This... is done. Out of five years, Shiners would later reopen. It would go over... Heavy rebranding as some still have a somewhat negative impression of the company. FNAF 2? Best brand entertainment is now more committed than ever to family fun and above all, safety. Sure, that's what they all say. They spend a small fortune on these new animatronics.
Anyways, Jeremy. Where do you think you can? Oh, I didn't see that last part. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh well. Something about Jeremy and where they fit in or something? I don't know. Is this the end? Mm -hmm. was amazing. <coughs> I'm just gonna be quiet and let this all play out. I have to say all the people who think this did a great job on it. Scene? The end. The post credit scene. No. Well, let's see what's in the extras menu. <coughs> oh god. Very fast bird. This iteration of Freddy is much taller and lankier than most. He is rocking his iconic top hat and bow tie. Both are outfitted with plaid material. Okay. Ah, okay. That makes sense. Bonnie the Bunny. Similar to Freddy, this iteration of Bonnie is much lankier than most other designs. He's been given a pair of stylish glasses and his color has shifted from dark indigo to a tealish shade of blue. I think it works well. Chica the Chicken. This iteration of Chica is themed not around food but sleeping. She, st she dons a nightgown, a sleeping cap, and her cupcake has a binky. How adorable. Foxy the Pirate. This pirate-themed iteration of Foxy is withered to maintain the iconic look that everyone loves. He wanted to push that theme a little further with the inclusion of lots of piercings. Yeah, I kind of noticed that. Balloon Baby. This iteration of Balloon Boy isn't a boy at all. He's actually a baby, hence the name. His face was made more doll-like to match the eerie vibe of the rest of the character cast. As always, he's sold his balloons and wearing his iconic propeller hat. That thing is horrifying. Burn it. The marionette. With her lengthy, spindly body, the situation of the marionette slash puppet is more ragdoll like. She's also been given a nose and a set of ears to add the creepy doll look that made her so iconic in Five Nights at Freddy's 2. Withered Freddy. During the final act of Junior's, Freddy was torn to shreds, leaving him with only one eye and a massive scar down his right eye. <coughs> River Bonnie. During the final act in Junior, Bonnie's face was turned off by Mangle and used as a mask by the player. Over Bonnie shares most identical features to his design in Five Nights at Freddy's 2. Yeah, that would actually explain a lot for that. Of course, it's not canon. This is fan game. Anyway, over Chica. During the final act in Junior, Chica's jaw was torn apart and ripped open. Much like her design in Five Nights at Freddy's 2, she probably got the most damage out of the entire animatronic cast. Poor Chica. Yeah, poor Chica. Whoever Foxy. 
Continuing our final act, Foxy takes quite the beating. His left ear is completely torn off. However, he was already pretty withered to begin with. Yeah. Withered Balloon Boy. I did not see that thing at all, but it's horrifying. Much like the Mirror Man Ed, Balloon Boy's porcelain head is completely shattered during Junior's final act. The cracks on his face reveal a creepy endoskeleton beneath. That thing should be burned. I'm just saying it right now. Wivered Marionette. That thing also should be burned. In Junior's final act, the Marionette's face is completely shattered by Mangle, revealing her horrific visage. And the Mangle. In Junior's final act, the Mangle is absolutely giant. Over time, the ghost haunting Junior is built it as her final form using different pieces of animatronic endoskeleton to create this monstrosity. During the final act, all the withered animatronics hop on a conveyor, sacrificing themselves to finish the main goal. I think they may have made a mistake. The ghost. <coughs> the ghost is the main antagonist of Junior's, as well as the one responsible for all the havoc. She appears to have a very strong connection to Power, seeking to erase him during the fi game's final act. Thankfully, you make it out alive and manage to free Paul Bear, trapping the ghost inside the barrens for the rest of her days. Paul Bear Paul Bear is the player's lovable and jolly friend that provides company in the campaign of juniors. He and the ghost seem to have an otherworldly connection and have caused a divide in reality, perhaps due to their similar deaths. The real question is, what is under the costume? I really want to find that out now. <laughs> Anyway, behind the scenes, here's a closer look into each character went through the own process. Okay, I'll just go through all of this. I have to say, modeling things, I've tried it, it's very hard, so seriously guys, really do appreciate all of this. It's, to the people who make it, it's in the very unlikely event they watched this, they did an amazing job. That thing looks so realistic. Oh. oh wait, yeah. Ah. Like they look like they would how they'd probably look if they were made in real life in like this time period. Yeah, this is amazing. Here's a closer look at the good majority of the Scrap Genius content that, was that never saw the light of day. A good chunk of these images were taken from the 2020 version of the game. While some of the content in these screenshots is pretty cool and interesting, redoing the game from the ground up was the best move for the game despite how long it took to do. I think it was worth it. Scrapped menu, scrapped office, scrapped office turned around, early te camera test, Scrapped Foxy Platformer, old camera feed, old ventilation inter wow, old tablet interface, yeah it still is very similar to the one we got, ready in office, old tablet interface, old camera feed, I actually kind of really like that, old office tool slash mechanic, scrapped inter infrared camera, what? Scrap menu hashtag 2, scrap mangle model, scrap mangle level, scrap lure interface, scrap camera feed. Wow, scrap upgrade menu. Wow. This all just looks amazing. Scrap bonnie jump scare, 
grabbed office, turned around with Foxy. So grabbed menu hashtag free. Make solid view of old office. Render model of old office. Material mode of old office. Outside view of old office. So, ugh. That thing's horrible. Scrapped hallway. Scrapped pizza corner. Scrapped rover. Scrapped meter. Scrapped kitchen. Scrapped the NAF2 office. Scrapped feeder. Scrapped foxy colors. Wow, this is all just really amazing. The ego set we hid. From the team, Korean Juniors was such a fun yet challenging experience, but no matter the, what, the community has always supported the game. Though it's blankly development process, to say thank you to all of the supporters, we picked a handful of incredible pieces of fan art created by super talented individuals. Junior's Paul Bear. Final trailer. Wow. This is all really cool. To the people who drug this, that's just really good and well done. So handsome. Aww. Oh, that's fun. Ooh, Lego. Yeah, and then now we have the extra renders. Oh, Jesus Christ. Wow. Oh, that's actually quite nice. Party hard. Juniors. Yeah, so this... This was amazing. I might do the extra shifts, that is if there's anything special that you can see when you do it, but otherwise, I think this is the last episode for now, and I hope you all liked, please consider liking and subscribing, and I will see you all in the next one. Goodbye.